Hey guys, Anita Fanita here. How is everyone? I know I, I said that I'll be back tomorrow, but sometimes tomorrow means the next day because I'm, I'm, I'm usually not able to do videos every single day. So if it's not the next day, expect my videos to be uh, the day after or sometimes even the day after that. <laughs> but, you know, since we're uh, in quarantine, I am uh, going to be trying to do more videos. Okay, guys, uh, so I'm going to be calling this the question of the day. <laughs> Uh, yesterday, uh, uh, I did ask a question of how many uh, brooches they think are going to be in today's bag, which is this one over here. And the answer is 14. Uh, so 14 brooches. And hang on, let's see. I snapshot it because I had to go back a lot of uh, a lot of comments. And thank you all for commenting and playing with me. It's really fun. I'm really enjoying this. So, um, okay, here it is. Okay, so the winner is Martha Posley. I hope I'm saying that right, Martha. And she wrote, I'm guessing there are 14 in the next game, uh, which, uh, what beautiful butter, wow, what beautiful butterfly, my, guys, I don't even know how to read sometimes. Okay, so let's start over. <laughs> I'm guessing there are 14 in the next game. Wow, what a beautiful, what beautiful butterfly brooches. The monarch looks so real. Thanks for sharing. Uh, thank you, uh, Martha, uh, for commenting. Congratulations. And uh, I, and I want to thank everybody again that participated. And there's going to be another one today. I'm going to call it the question of the day. <laughs> so uh, the question of the day uh, for, uh, for tomorrow is how many brooches are in this one here, which we're going to be doing this one. So please go ahead and make your guesses in the comments. And let me know. Let me show um, the winning prize here for Martha. Okay, Martha. I said I would put butterflies from, and what I do is I put um, uh, items from the from the lots. So this is one of the butterflies. Well, this one is, has the mother of pearl wings, and I decided to do go ahead and put another one here. It's a little tiny one that you can. Uh, it's also a brooch vintage V uh, clasp there that you can uh, maybe put them both together. And since I didn't want them to be alone. I did go ahead and add uh, this beautiful sparkly gold tone and similar in colors uh, necklace here with fauceted beautiful beads. So uh, yeah, these are going to go to the winner, which is Martha. Again, thank you for, uh, for commenting. So we're going to go ahead and open uh, today's bag. So let's go ahead and see what we have, what goodies are in this one. And they are all themed, so okay. This one here is the horses. Yay! Okay. Oh my goodness, look at this guy here. Oh my god. This is so cute. Look how adorable this is. Look at that. Isn't it? Guys, I, 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 I can't stand it when there's things in the book <laughs> showing up, so I'm going to pull it away. Look how cute he is. It's enamel rhinestone hair, a little green rhinestone eye. I even love the little purple feet. Oh, I don't know if they're called feet. <laughs> I'm not going to get into it, <laughs> but it is so cute. Okay, we don't have any maker's marks, but it's definitely adorable. So this is one. Okay, let's go and open another one. This is really cute too. Okay. Aww. Okay, this one has three different uh, horse heads uh, again um, I'm guessing maybe it's copper uh, we have um, a cup well it's probably brass we have a copper color one brass and silver really pretty I see a mark on this one and I, like I did yesterday I forgot to bring uh, the magnifying glass no it's over here I well I did forget to bring it but it's close by okay this one says K and T in the back and it's in really great great condition really pretty put that aside oh we have a carousel so cute okay this is cute there's three horses cute little carousel horses there's little pearls in the centers we have some pearls here and no marks but this one in the back it has scroll work so I'm guessing it's from 19 um, that 1928 um, company I'm checking to see if there's any pearls missing or anything. No, I don't see anything. Okay, so this is another one. Look at this one. This one is a zebra. <laughs> I'm guessing it's a zebra. 
Okay, look at that. Isn't that cute? Very pretty. I love the red eye and the rhinestones. Black enamel. No maker's mark. Very clean in the back. Okay, another beauty. Very cute. Okay, we're going to open another carousel horse here. Okay, and oh, looks like this one stone fell out of this one, but that's an easy fix. So, yeah, this one is a gold tone one. Again, very pretty. Uh, it's missing the stone uh, over here. We'll put in a new, I'll put in a new stone. It's very cute. And no marks, but cleaner in the back. And then, what do we have here? Oh, another one that's a carousel. <laughs> okay, we have this gold tone one. Okay, very cute. And this one does have a mark in the back. Let's see if I can see what it says. AJC. A, yeah, AJC in the back. Okay. Very fun. And we have some smaller ones here. And let's get to it. Okay, this is a really cute little one here. Enamel. And has a little white spot on the on the forehead and th that's not a missing or chipped or anything that's how it is and no marks on this one it is an older piece oh it's a cute little tiny one okay we have this one here that's a pin okay this one's on the inside of a horseshoe and it's a baby horse and the mother and I see something back here. Uh, it says 3018 in the back. Okay. Then we have this one here that's a rocking horse. So cute. <laughs> oh, that's a little adorable one. And I see something back there, guys. Hold on. It says SD in the back. Again, enameling is all there. Pretty cool. And we have some other little ones here. I think this one is a deer. No, I thought it was a deer. It's a horse. <laughs> it's a silver one. No marks. Okay. And we have another one here oh oh this one's leg broke oh it's okay okay oh that's this one is actually a similar one to this one but this one's a little tiny foot uh, one of the legs is broken but it's okay i'll put that one in crafts look how cute this one is it has two little pearls on here oh this one's legs must have came, came off too is that how it's supposed to be? Let me check, guys. Nope, that's how it's supposed to look. Okay, um, that's how that's how it's supposed to be. Uh, two little pearls, and then there's a rhinestone eye. And I thought the legs were because their legs are on the shorter side, but that but that's how they are. <laughs> okay, we have two more here. This one. and then we have this one here okay guys uh, what I'm going to do is right now I'm going to stop the video I have more butterflies to show you guys I'm going to open another butterfly bag give me a second okay so I opened another butterfly bag I'm going to show you guys some more butterflies okay let's see here oh wow okay Look at that. Woohoo! <laughs> uh, look at all those beautiful sparkly uh, rhinestones on this one. And this one can be worn as a brooch and a pendant. So it serves two purposes. This is really cute. Okay. And we have this one with the rhinestones. Wow. Pretty one here too. Oh my goodness. I love butterflies. 
and I did list uh, all the all the butterflies that I showed you in the previous video they should be in my Etsy store I have the link below I will go ahead and put these ones up too uh, as soon as I get a chance look at this one oh wow okay this is the back another beautiful one and we have another one here and some more oh my goodness this is pretty too the beautiful beautiful blue stones and they're on not only blue there's some green ones here some AB stones and a gold tone the back okay, and yes there's more <laughs> okay this one is oh dropped it a uh, cute little butterfly here, here with the silver wings and it kind of looks like a uh, turquoise uh, full turquoise here in the center and this has a mark Jerry's this one is by Jerry's okay and we have two in this bag oh look at this one very pretty enamel kind of this area is the cloisonne design over here really pretty colors and the back is just this pretty <laughs> sparkly in the back clean and we have this one here and I see something back here it's the Liz Claiborne okay we have a Liz Claiborne butterfly enamel the mark is in the center and we have this one here red black enamel very pretty these are like the ones that are like from the side kind of we have both wings this way and rhinestones here for the body and it is clean in the back and we have an enamel one here very cute and look at this one here I really like this one and this one can be worn again as a necklace you can just put like through here and out here the chain actually you can put it through all three hoops <laughs> in the back and look at how pretty this one is sparkling rhinestones let me check and make sure there are none missing before I say there aren't and there are not okay this is really pretty okay. and we have a few more I'm going to show you guys look how pretty this one is this reminds me of the Monet ones I don't know if this is Monet or not but we'll check this is really pretty it has those you know unfluttering flutters flutter <laughs> flutters <laughs> that don't flutter and in the back here Yesterday we were discussing what noise butterflies make <laughs> and I don't know guys <laughs> I was talking uh, with my uh, with my uh, with my daughter and I was saying do they make kind of like a buzz buzz noise and she goes no that's a bee or a fly I was like it's not blah blah <laughs> so I don't I don't know what kind of noise they make but it, this one is really pretty with the, with the with the rhinestones over here on top and it is Monet and let's one is black one with rhinestones for the wings really cute uh, gunmetal color no marks okay, we have that one and we have two tiny ones here okay we have this one really pretty a black and silver toned one here and then we have an enamel one here in beige I see something here in the back of the enamel oh the enamel one is Monet so we have a little Monet one and this one over here okay guys uh, let me know about the question of the day how many you think are in the bag for tomorrow and we will go ahead and do it tomorrow if if not tomorrow uh, just remember it's it's gonna be either tomorrow or the next day so uh, I hope you guys had fun uh, with the brooches today we'll do some more soon and I also still have the, you know, the big lots of jewelry that, you know, the two, the two hundred dollar ones. I will get to those as soon as I'm done with the brooches. I uh, hope you guys had fun. Uh, and don't forget to hit the like button while you're here. And guys, in, and for the question of the day, 
uh, you have to be uh, subscribers to qualify uh, for uh, for the prize. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I will put the subscribe button here somewhere. <laughs> and I'll see you guys soon. Thank you for watching. Bye, everyone.